Okay, well, I guess when I grow up, I still want to be an astronaut. Um, <laughs> um, I've always really liked space and space science, and I actually majored in aerospace um, for all my degrees, uh, bachelor's, master's, and PhD. Um, I fell into doing energy research because my advisor in graduate school um, was in the mechanical and aerospace department doing energy research in fast ignition, which is related to you know, how I ended up on NIF. Um, and I love it. I definitely love it. Um, but you know, I'm still hoping, and I applied last time to um, the last call for astronauts. I was a little bit young, hadn't finished my PhD yet. Um, but should they put up a new call, I will definitely apply. Working on NIF right now, it's a huge team project. Um, and I'm an experimental physicist, so I like being in the lab, and I like touching things and setting up experiments and diagnostics. The team that I work with every day here at the lab is just absolutely amazing. Not only are they like the smartest people I've ever met and they continue to challenge me every day, um, but they are like incredibly nice, caring individuals where, um, you know, they really care about you as a person and, you know, they want you to have they demand a lot from you because they demand a lot from themselves, but they also want you to have work-life balance. They want you to be happy every day at work. And I, I think that's what makes this such a supportive environment. And it's collaborative, um, not just on, you know, maybe a small experiment that you're doing, but we're collaborating as, as large teams as well, where we feed off of each other. Um, we're, we're very open about what we learn, whether it's you know something that is helpful to an experiment, or maybe something that you know we didn't understand before, and we asked a certain team to go and look at it, and they say, oh, you know what, we've been making this mistake all along, or there's just something else that happened that you know we didn't realize was a big issue, um, and nobody assigns blame, and you know we just we take that information and build off of it. Part of the reason I feel really lucky to work here at the lab. Um, and certainly to work on NIF with the great team of people that I do get to interact with every day, is that you're really judged based on what you bring to the team and how you perform um, and what you can contribute. And it doesn't matter if you're a guy or a girl, what age you are, um, what your past experiences are, what you wear to work every day, it doesn't matter. The only thing that matters is what you manage to contribute and how you can help advance science and our understanding to get to our end goal. I do know hearing from friends who complain about going to work every day that, you know, I don't have that problem. I am pretty excited to wake up every morning and come into work um, and see what new challenges are waiting for me in my inbox. Um, and, and maybe to see the results from the shot last night. Like that is really, really cool to wake up every morning and be like, oh, what happened last night? What did we learn? Um, and. You know, maybe it makes me an enormous nerd, but uh, you know, I, I think that's shared too. That's the cool thing. Everybody here is a nerd, and uh, and we enjoy being around each other because we acknowledge that, and uh, uh, and it's it's like the shared experience to that we you know, you're all kind of going into the unknown together, and you know you can learn from each other and feed off of each other to kind of push that forward.